Now on to our dinosaur of the day, Sinraptor, which is a request from Keegan via Facebook. So thanks, Keegan. Sinraptor's name means Chinese thief. There's two species. There's Sinraptor dongai and Sinraptor hippogensis. Philip J. Curry and Xian Zhao described Sinraptor in 1994. They named Dongai in their 1994 paper a new carnosaur, Dinosauria therapoda, from the Jurassic of Xinjiang, People's Republic of China, published in the Canadian journal Earth Sciences. The holotype was found in the Shishugo Formation during a joint Chinese and Canadian expedition called the Dinosaur Project in 1987, and this formation means stone tree ravine. The Sinraptor Dongai skeleton was mostly complete, minus a lot of the tail and arms, and the holotype was found lying on its right side. It had a skull that was almost 36 inches or 90 centimeters long. The species name is in honor of Dong Jiming, a paleontologist, and Dong Jiming worked to describe the dinosaur Yang Chuanosaurus, which Yang Chuanosaurus and Sinraptor are closely related. So actually, Sinraptor hepingensis was originally named Yang Chuanosaurus hepingensis in 1992 because they're so closely related, but then they were renamed in Curry and Zhao's paper because they found new material that more closely resembled Sinraptor than the holotype for Yang Chuanosaurus. The new material that they found for Sinraptor hepingensis includes a skull, axial skeleton, pectoral and pelvic girdles, and left femur. Sinraptor is not actually a raptor, even though it has raptor in its name. That means it's not a dromaeosaurid. And that's not the first time that a non-dromaeosaurid has raptor in its name. Another example is Fukui raptor. It's so catchy. How can they not resist? I guess so. <laughs> so Sinraptor was a theropod that lived in the late Jurassic. It's an allosauroid theropod that is more primitive than allosaurids such as Allosaurus and Acrocanthosaurus. Its premaxilla had four teeth, which is why it's considered more primitive. The closest relative is another theropod that was found in China, Yangchuanosaurus, but Sinraptor had a longer lower skull. Sinraptor was bipedal, and it was about 10 feet or 3 meters tall, and 23.5 feet or 7.2 meters long, but this is based on a not fully grown Sinraptor. It was probably a top predator, though not the largest necessarily in its habitat, and it probably hunted smaller dinosaurs and juvenile sauropods. Other animals that lived around the same time were turtles, lizards, sauropods related to Mementosaurus, Hypsilophodonts, and mammals. They lived in a mild climate that had seasons, and the Sinraptor dongai specimen had 25 partially healed bite wounds, probably from fighting with other Sinraptors over food or territory. And it had a lot of head wounds. It had puncture wounds in its skull. It also had a broken rib. You can see a Sinraptor hepingensis at the Jigong Dinosaur Museum in Jigong, China. Sinraptor is part of Carnosauria, a group of allosaurs and close relatives that lived in the Jurassic and Cretaceous, and this group includes Gigantosaurus and Tyrannotitan. They had large eyes, a long narrow skull, and thighs that were longer than their shins. Sinraptor is also part of Metriacanthosauridae. These are large predators, some as large as 33 feet or 10 meters, and they're part of the clad. Sinraptoridae. Sinraptorids are large theropods that lived in the Jurassic and Asia, again similar to allosaurids and more derived than megalosaurids, and this group includes Sinraptor and Yangchuanosaurus, not surprisingly. 